My name's Jerry Morby. I'm doing intelligence and strategic studies and I'm from a village near Reading in the UK. My scheme covers the fields of intelligence and strategic studies. It looks at very wide areas of uh, strategy. One of the modules I'm doing right now is based on contemporary strategy that we're dealing with today. The choice of modules that I have is really appealing to me because it means that if I'm interested in certain things I can choose to do the modules on them and I can discount everything that I'd prefer not to study. A lot of the staff know what they're talking about, they've been doing this for years and this department being um, renowned internationally it does attract a lot of speakers. For instance we had the former Director General of MI5 come in during the last semester. I think that's probably the one thing I would say most is most unique um, that we do get such high level um, talks. There's more responsibility for a master's student, certainly, uh, who are expected to be able to work more independently. You still get the similar levels of help if you actually need it, but in general the standard of your work is just expected to be that little bit higher and that little bit more professional. The lecturers that I have, they're all really um, experts in their field. It's really helpful to have that because then, again, if I ever need help with them, I can go and see them in their office hours and they'll talk to me about it. I'd quite like to work within the defence industry because it's in an area that I've been studying quite intensely for a while. But I'm considering doing a PhD in a couple of years after I've done a few years in employment. The principal skill I think I've picked up um, during this year has been uh, presentation skills, generally becoming more confident at presenting. We had the Masters Convention during the first semester where you have to do a group presentation to the entire Masters and there's various members of staff are there as well to ask challenging questions. It's a very friendly department, it's very informal. It's nice having everything in one place, you've got all your seminar rooms down here and obviously you've got all the staff in the building so they're really easy to find. Rossity is a new building, it's um, dedicated to housing postgraduates, there's six flats so 60 people can live in there. The main difference is that it's a lot bigger. Um, my room is about twice the size of the one I had before, I think, and the kitchen is definitely twice the size. Plus, you get a TV, so you can't complain. You've got the two libraries you've got the University Library and then you've got the National Library of Wales, which is a very useful resource, especially for international politics, I think, because it's got access to every text that I've ever needed, and it's a quiet place to work as well um, if you ever need it. In terms of other stuff that would be interesting, obviously, you've got the Arts Centre, you get the discount at the bookshop as well, which is always helpful for a student. Obviously it's nice to have its own cinema in there as well.